Hey guys, how you doing? Um, it's been a while since I've seen, I think my last video I made was in December, and so um, I'm sure this video will be like a million years long if I actually decide to catch up on every single thing that's going on in my life right now. But um, just a couple things I did, was excited about, got me kind of motivated again was um, last weekend was the World Natural Hair, Fest, Hair Convention in Atlanta. And you know last year I went and I made um, a video and did a couple things, but this year I was actually able to go to the Curly Curls Rock, um, I guess you would call it a meetup, and it was on Friday night, it was downtown, and um, it was awesome, I had a really good time, it was put on by Lexi with the curls, but anyway, so it was tons of naturals there, I ended up bringing my sister and she was so amazing, she's also a natural, but she's just really not following a lot of the trends and she's not on YouTube and everything so she was really amazed at some of the networking that was going on and I got to meet a lot of people that I um, tweet with all the time and that was really fun too because you can recognize faces but if they were to give you just their regular name you still may not even know who they are so a lot of like Twitter aliases were being flown around the room and that was just kind of hilarious and um I just got to realize that there's so many subscribers actually in Atlanta, so that's kind of cool too. Um, but I did want to show you a couple things I bought. Um, I had to do like kind of a drive-by to the World Natural Hair Convention on um, Sunday. I got, well actually on Friday night there was a raffle and you had a gift bag and I was, I'm not going to do any products that I got, I'm just going to kind of show you a couple of accessories. So I actually won this shirt. And it is so cute and it's by Be Natural Apparel. So cute, I got it free. So. I was excited about that. I got to head up to the DJ stand and get my prize. And then, um, I was just walking along and someone who I, I, I follow on Twitter is, um, what was it, Tomoka Twist. And I actually was able to buy one and it says, um, it's good hair. And how you do it is just kind of wrap it around your head twist it to your however tight you want it to be. A lot of girls who wear locks will wear this, but it works well with my hair. Um, and I'm going to tell you about what's going on with my hair in a minute. So I got that and I was really excited and I really was trying to spend full price, but she wouldn't let me. So that was really sweet of her because she had had discounted price for the convention. And so, hey, I'm so happy I got it and it's so cute. love supporting black businesses. And then I got this scarf, which, you know, you can wear it around your neck or in your hair. And this was out of a company from um, Montgomery, Alabama. And they were a non-profit, and they made scarves and sold, like, vintage clothing. I actually got a cute little vintage dress there, too, but that's how I would wear that. Oh, it fell down. All right. And from that same company, I got to, you know what, I have to figure out the name. I'll, I'll figure out the name of the website and put it below. But they had all these Natural Girl t-shirts. And so I'm going to show you, they were like three for, three for 20, I think they were. Kind of inexpensive. So, of course, I couldn't just get one. I had to get three. And um, so the first one is this one. Oh, that's so cute. It says Rock Natural, and it's a raglan, and it's purple if you can't see the color, and it's super cute. I have a picture of me with it on already, and then um, this one is a little heart, and it's like pick me, like a little afro pick, and actually here it says it's, um, the company is actually called Natural Deja Vu. That's the name of the company. So I will post a link to the actual website. And they do like some of the thrift um, thrift deals and seals out of Montgomery, Alabama, which is, I mean, randomly very, very cute. Um, the next shirt I got was this one. This is all from the same company. And it's like a little nerdy Afro woman with one of the little scarves on. And it's so cute. I can't wait to wear it. I just want to wear them all at the same time. 
Now this one, um, I got from a company where the woman was the designer of these really cute dresses. And I wasn't, I didn't get a dress. You couldn't buy any dresses from her. It was kind of like she was showing them and she had a catalog. But it's the I'm, I'm me company. And this is this shirt. She actually let me have a t-shirt. And it's really, really cute. It looks really cute with the skirts that she had. So I want to actually order one of the skirts or get someone to make me a skirt that looked like the one she had. Um, yeah, so of course there was tons of um, products. I was actually able to get the um, some hair products for my little girl. And then I did purchase some Uncle Funky Daughter. I never tried any of that, so I'm going to probably do a review on that later. Um, speaking of taking care, um, I got a haircut. Um, I actually went and got my hair um, blown out again. And she... Um, First of all, she yelled at me because the last time I got my hair trimmed was in September. And it is, it was April at the time. Yelled at me, whatever I've been doing, what the heck is going on. And then, um, so she was able to get rid of about two to two and a half inches of hair, which was very good because I've been trying to get rid of, um, you know, from the damage, the heat damage a long time ago. So it's finally... Um, I'll probably need to go one more time. She said go every eight weeks. So I'll probably go in a couple more weeks and maybe get the last um, quarter of an inch to an inch off. And I think that my hair will be totally um, damage free. So um, this is, what is this? What did I do? Bantu Not Out. And I used um, Miss Jessie's Curly Pudding. Oh my gosh. I have to ret retract a statement about Miss Jessie products. I actually used it and I used a little teeny bit and it went a long way. Like I did my hair soaking wet, co-washed it soaking wet, left a little conditioner on, put coconut oil on it, and a little teeny bit of Miss Jessie's curly pudding. Like a little bit, run it through and that's it. And when I took my curl, took my um, bantu knots out, because I did like maybe four sections in my hair, took it out, um, my hair was so soft and just, I mean, I couldn't keep my hands out of it. So I, you know, took them apart and stuff and um, this is maybe, this is the second day. So I, when I went to go wrap it again, I did put a little bit more, I sprayed it down with water, put a little bit more um, curly pudding and coconut oil and put it back up and twisted it and um, this is the result. So. I really like it. I think it's really cute and I love the little bang thing going on. Um, yeah, so my hair is, I, I really am liking this length, especially going into the summertime. I feel like I can do a lot more with it and um, the ends are, there's no split ends. I mean, she definitely got rid of all of the broken split ends that I could possibly have. So I was happy about that. Um, and I will post a picture of, um, right after I got my hair snipped and straightened and stuff. In case you wanted to see that. Um, oh, and look at my nails. That was one of the latest things. I did get um, a UV gel on my nails, but I've always, I think I've shown you this one before. Like I am a fan of Zoya nail polish and this is Kara. And in the winter time, I always do like really nude, neutral colors. But I felt like, you know, giving something to the girls for and bringing out my bright colors a little bit early. So, yeah, but besides that, nothing else really is going on. Life is just really crazy and hectic. I'm starting school again uh, in a couple days. School for me, not me schooling other people because that's ongoing. Um, so wish me luck on that. And I, I really am going to be trying to update more often. I got a lot of motivation um, when I went last weekend. And I'm just looking at subscribers and I have a lot of new ones. Hey, how are you? Um, and so I want to be more interactive than I have been in the last year. So, um, yeah, that's about it. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.